Hey fellow cocktail lovers. So today um, Kim got some stuff from CW Spirits called Sip and Shine and I actually do not know anything about this so I'm just here for taste testing and I'm gonna let Kim run this show. Here we go. Okay so Sip Shine, there are four flavors. They're flavored moonshine ready to drink cocktails. So we have lemon which is called Arnold Shiner. Raspberry Shineaid, Watermelon Chillade, and Shineberry Sweet Tea. So we're just going to open these and taste them. Um, they're made in Michigan, which is right across the lake from us. So it's a big lake, though. So it's a big lake. Probably, probably not, lake not Superior. Neighbors. Superior meaning big. Yeah, real big. So shall we start with the Arnold Shiner. Arnold Shiner it up. All right, this is in honor of my Uncle Arnold. I don't know. Ooh. Holy Hannah, that's strong. <laughs> <laughs> it's good, but strong. They're 40 proof in this little baby can. It's a big burst of lemon. It kind of reminds me of a lemon drop Ooh, yeah. with a little bit of burn to it. If that yeah. makes any sense, a lemon drop with a little burn. So It's very good, though. Raspberry, shiny. This one is berries and lemonade. I have high expectations. I love lemonade. This face is not because it's bad. This face is because they're, they're very strong. They're, um, what do I want to say? They're very full and robust. Yeah. So, um, this one's kind of tart. Yeah, it's good. This one is watermelon chillade. So watermelon and chili flavored moonshine. Oh, your favorite watermelon. <laughs> I know. I don't have high hopes for this one for myself. I'm not a watermelon person. Ooh, but it's good. It's real good. And if you've seen any of our other videos with watermelon in them, you'll know that I don't pretend to like it if I don't, and that's good. It's got a sweet aftertaste, like a Jolly Rancher almost. Mm, yeah, maybe that's why I like it. <laughs> kind of reminds me of a Jolly Rancher. I mean, it's not over watermelon yet. <laughs> And by no means is it spicy. I was expecting it to be spicy. Yeah, me too. And then this is Shineberry Sweet Tea. So again, I'm not an iced tea drinker, so we'll see. Sweet tea, berries, flavored moonshine. It's good. I don't taste any iced tea. So I think it's delicious. So I'm going to say these are all very robust mm -hmm. and I'm gonna they're heavy this so they're sippers which is now why I see it why it's called sip and shine um they all have that um whatever the taste is that they are they all have like that jolly rancher type yeah. taste afterwards which is actually really good yeah. so um I like them all you can get them on CW spirits yep and we'll put the link to uh, CW Spirits in our des the description of this video um, or if you're watching this on one of our other social media platforms it's in our link tree um, but if you've had these do you mix them with something else I've seen people mix them with other liquors what what do you mix with yours we'd love to know and give it a shot um, I've also seen people do the thing where they put a hole down here and open the top and they just chug the whole thing at once. And I would not <laughs> recommend this. This is, I'm saying this, it's a very thick drink. Yeah. And I, that's why I said, now I understand why they call it sip and shine. Yeah. Because I'm the type, I like like a Jack Daniels lemonade and I'll drink it and you don't realize there's any liquor in it and you're just drinking lemonade. This, you know, you're drinking something and there's nothing wrong with that. And it has that very, if you like Jolly Ranchers or things that are like that, this is what it seriously reminds me of. It gives a nice, it's robust, it's filling, 
and mm -hmm. it's also sweet, but it's not over the top sweet either. Yeah. I mean, it's a like you know you tasted something good sweet. Right. Yeah. As opposed to just you know like something you just taste lemon and that's it and you don't know anything else. But right. I I would give them all an eight out of ten for sure. I'd say eight out of ten for sure. Even the the ones that I thought I wasn't gonna like, like the tea and the watermelon, are good. Mm -hmm. So I'd say go for it. Give them a try. Um, again, C CW Spirits is yep, where we got them. CW Spirits. If um, you want to see us try something mixed with them, we'd love to do that for you. So drop us a line, send us a DM, and we'll give it a try. Um, but until next time. Cheers. Cheers.